as you see this is getting starting to look a little bit repetitive now and that's all it really is once we get past the main um, sort of installation and configuration stage after this it just gets a look what well, can get a little bit tedious so glibc this is the main c library again it needs its own build directory so we'll create that change into it and run the configure command and now we can make it this command here Right, so that is built and we can install the package. Now we've got this caution box here and it's saying that we need to check the basic functions, make sure what we've built is working. So we put these commands in, these three commands. So that's a little C program we've created there. That command has compiled it. And this command is just going to look at some of the data um, inside the compiled program. And you can see it's looking for the file which is in the tools directory which we've been utilizing with these uh, last few packages we built and it says just check that that's the output and it does look identical so that's looking good so far 
Now we can remove these dummy files, but it's neither here nor there because we're going to remove this build directory and the glibc directory right now. So it doesn't really matter that we do whether we do that or not. So tidy up that glibc uh, directory and move on to the next package.